Also breaking tonight at 5, terrifying new surveillance video right here showing the moment that a pickup truck drove right into the path of an oncoming commuter rail train. Louisa Moeller is live at the scene now in Wakefield. Louisa? Well, Lisa, Liam, witnesses tell me that truck drew, drove right through the safety gate here at the crossing before it was struck by that train. And as you said, it was all caught on camera. This was the devastating aftermath of a head-on collision between a pickup truck and a commuter rail train in Wakefield. At the beginning, I was crying and I was shaking and I was calling 911. The MBTA says a train signal sounded as the truck veered around the railroad gate at the Broadway Street crossing. And what happened next was violent. All of a sudden, um, the white pickup truck came out of, I didn't even see it, came out of nowhere and the train hit it and it went all the way down. Passengers say a small jolt was the only indication of the wreckage at the front of their train. Well, we we're just going along normally and then there was a bump and everything just suddenly stopped. We were all jolted. The 70-year-old truck driver was med flighted to the hospital with serious injuries. Now, the MBTA says that train was operating at 29 miles per hour in a 30 mile per hour zone here. None of the passengers were injured. Thank goodness they were all brought to Boston by bus and trains are now operating normally here on this line. Live in Wakefield, Louisa Moeller, WBZ News.